what a great day. I know some of you probably drove up this morning and saw all these people standing out in the cold weather on the west side of the Capitol and thought, what in the world? Why would people stand out there in this cold weather? Well, it's about the, the beauty of Colorado and, and capturing, capturing it on film, in the cinema world, and being able to really promote that. I want to share a couple of things that um, we talked about this morning with so many of our, our guests that are here in the Capitol today. And it is an honor for me to get to stand with Representative Massey, who has been such a champion for film industry and cinema in Colorado. And eight years later, here we are, and hopefully we will be able to uh, really walk away with, with a great accomplishment at the end of this session. But Colorado spends millions of dollars per year educating students in film and new media. Media. The Colorado Film School is ranked in the top 25 in the nation, and unfortunately, many of these students that are well-educated in our state go to our neighboring states, and they benefit because of us educating them, but they can't get a job in Colorado because we're not really promoting the film industry. I'm really particularly proud of a group of young Colorado students who are natives and who have decided to stay in Colorado to promote the film industry, a group called Dutchman's Run, and remember that name, Dutchman's Run, under the direction of one of my former middle school students, Jeff Nixon, and produced by Brian Bell. They're beginning a, a um, full-blown um, cinema uh, production this summer, a full feature on uh, a Western, 1800s Western in Colorado. It'll be filmed here in the Denver area. And an exciting future lies ahead for this group and many others um, that are increasing the incentives to support and encourage filmmaking in Colorado. We are currently 46th in the nation for providing incentives and creating